Hello boys and girls, it's between Christmas and New Year, um, so this is my first time out properly since the 11th of uh, November. Now, as you know, I've said in my other videos, a lot of my permissions are all planted, uh, so detecting is hard to come by at the moment, but I've been invited down by a little Welsh cake over there, Steve Petterkin. So, um, very appreciated. Thanks for inviting me down, mate. Um, he's off swinging, and uh, so I better go and join him. Uh, targets for today? I don't know, just anything good, really, or anything average. You know, I'd love to find a cartwheel penny. He said he's found one on these fields before, so he's open, eh? Right, he's off swinging. I'm chit chatting. Less of it. Let's get digging. I'll see you at the first decent signal. All right, see you in a bit. Right, our first decent signal. It's a 2022. Very boggy down here. What have we got there? Not exactly what I was after. That looks like it's a clip in it. Yeah, they attach to a set of reins or a, or dog lead. Running up a nice tone now. I do believe there's another tone in the bottom of there, probably another part of this. Uh, we'll have a little route round in there, and uh, if it is, we'll come back. If not, we'll see at the next hole. Right, this one is a solid 16. It was. Oh, dropped out somewhere in there. <laughs> Another bit of rubbish by the looks of it. Yeah. What was it? A button. Looks like a button. An old stud type button. Yeah, nothing on it. Nothing on the back. Right, see the next. Oh, right, this one was ringing in a quite a low. You know, around about a fifteen, sixteen. And I literally just caught the glint of that sticking at the side of the wall. And uh, I've learned in the past not to let myself get uh, carried away with seeing that until I dig it out. <laughs> and that's why. Oh well. It's got to be something decent. If there's nothing in this field, we've got another one to tackle anyway. So, what we'll see in a bit. Uh, that was ringing in a uh, 16. Because it was so round. <laughs> Took a bit of finding in the old but it was there it wasn't even iffy for any reason and I thought it would have been a bit scratchy um, but uh, no Pekin's really showing me all the treasures around here <laughs> right I'll carry on and we'll hopefully find someone else for you see you in a bit right try to keep you out of the wind Oh, oh put him out. Oh, it's a coin. Oh, he's a toasted one. Very toasted. And even worth cleaning that one up to be honest I'll clean it up when I get home and if it's anything great you'll see it now uh, next target was a uh, 10 it's like a little pewter button or a broken shank 
Alright, this one was a 16. Oh, I'm hazarding a guess, it's probably a uh, button. Yeah, there you are, four old button. Better than a kick in the knackers. Alright, see if we can find anything else. We've got something down in the bottom of here, looks round. I don't know what it could be. Oh, you bugger. I thought it was going to be a big ass coin or something then, but it's just uh, that I do believe is probably the uh, internals of a gas gauge regulator. Ah, got me upset then. I thought it was a big ass coin. Oh well, never mind. I'll see you at the next. Um, that one, I have got no idea what that's off. No idea at all. It was a bit of an iffy signal, but you had to dig it. You had to dig it. Right. Got a think. Well, I think there's a coin ball here. Um. I can see an edge just in there. That. Is it a coin or button? There's a button in it. Yep, boring button. I can see why Petacan struggles to get videos out at the moment. <laughs> He's got fields like mine, not a lot of give at the moment. But uh, we'll keep prodding on. We haven't stopped for dinner yet. Who knows what we might do? I might even put the big coil on, or maybe the six inch if it's a bit trashy. I might even break out the simplex and give her a bit of a run. Who knows? Right, we'll see you in a bit. Right, we've got an 11 here. Oh, yes. Now we're talking. Why, oh, crusty. Uh, proper. So a little bit of patina in there. This is wafer thin, this is. I don't even think it's a coin. Got a little tab there. If I can get anything off that, I'll pull a picture up. I'll give it a bit of a clean up at home and uh, see if I can get anything off it. And if there is anything I can get off it, you'll see it now. Right, got another round in the ground here, but I don't know what it is, whether it's a button or a coin. <clears throat> Your God. Just saw the back of it. I just thought, I thought it saw what was the uh, edge of a hammer. <laughs> uh, but no, it's a pewter button. Uh, shank's just about intact, it's been bent over. And uh, nothing on the front. And the shanks just broke. <laughs> oh well. Never mind, we're finding bits, but uh, nothing really to brag about yet. I mean, uh, Petkins had uh, George II, but uh, pretty toasted. You can just about make some of that on it. Right, we'll keep plodding on. I'll see you in a bit. Oh, we have some laughs. Right, we're uh, back from a spot of dinner. So we're back in a different field. Uh, Pelican's uh, gone through the gate over that way. Um, and first target in this field is the uh, the Moo Tube. You can't go metal detecting without finding one of these. Uh, they do ring up a nice little tone that you got to dig. Um, but uh, it's uh, just gone uh, just gone 20 past one in the afternoon. Now the sun's come out. Uh, still got a bit of wind, but uh, it's keeping us cool. 
So uh, we're going to head off uh, down behind me now to stand next to this hedgerow and then work our way back into the uh, middle of the uh, into the middle of the field. So let's crack on. We'll see you in the next decent tone. Well, I've got a 16 here. It looks like I've got a, either a coin or a lead, possibly a lead token. Or maybe just a bit of lead. Well, it's round. If there was anything on it, it probably would have been worn down. It looks too smooth for it to be worn down. Maybe it's just a bit flat lead. Oh well. Well, right, see you in the next one. Alright, that one was ringing in a 16. It's got three holes on the back there. And a little recessed piece here. Who knows what that could be off. Bit the best thing I've had since uh, we come back after dinner. Rod going. Any van? Yeah, uh, uh, tin fall in this one as well. Yeah. Alright, <sighs> we'll keep plodding on. We'll see if we can find some up. See you in a bit. Alright, had an iffy 16 out of here. I nearly passed on it. Let's take a Digging all that of a crap, but I'm glad I didn't in a way. It's uh, part of a thimble. I'm sure it's not complete, but a uh, bit of history. You know, I want to clean up and put them in the box when I get home. So, uh, something decent anyway. Well, half decent. Hope we'll see you in the next one. Right, this one is ringing up a 2021. 20, I just hope it's a coin. Oh, is that a coin? Yeah, it's a coin, but I think he's another toasted one. But I'll take that. It's been a fairly quiet, uh, been a fairly quiet day. Well, for finds wise, good finds. Uh, um, he is toasted. I'll, uh, I'll give it a bit of a clean up at home, and if I can find anything on it, you'll see it now. All right, what well, could be the last find of the day? There's a bullet casing, ringing up at seven. Uh, we're just heading our way back uh, now across the fields, back to where the cars are. And uh, hopefully we'll um, find something on the way back. Yeah, you never had been, no, I never know I'd been there. All right, hopefully we'll see you in a bit. All right, now it's the, uh, the bit that you've all been waiting for to see all the good stuff. All the crap stuff that I gotta find to get all the good stuff down here. So there you go, got all this, all this crap. Basically, to get a few good things. Tin can, Red Bull. I've had enough of Red Bull ever since that F1 race. Uh, shotgun end, pigeon ring, four old button, pewter buttons. You name it, I found it. So the question is, if you're new into this hobby, what's the best machine to get? There is no definite answer. You can be running the Knox like I am. Petacom was uh, running the Cruiser. Um, it's got more experience than me. Well, I think it's a pretty even day. If you don't walk yeah. over it, you ain't gonna find it. Um, so there is, yeah. Do your research. There's no machine better than the other. You know, it just depends on the history and the ground. So, after that, thank you very much, mate, for inviting me down. That's all right, don't worry, anytime. Oh, dear. Wish we'd have found more. I wish I'd have found a cartwheel penny, but uh, that'll do it. We've only done a few fields and didn't spend a lot of time in most of them, really, did we? No, no. Just wondering, wondering we were. Yeah. Who was he talking about Terry we were? <laughs> <laughs> Terry, we love you. <laughs> 
But uh, right, until the next time, once again, Steve, thanks for inviting me down. No worries. And uh, we'll see you all on the next hunt. Uh, hope you've had a good Christmas and I hope you all have a great new year. And hopefully 2022 will be a lot better. We'll see you on the next hunt in 2022. Ta-da.